Hey man, it's the ISO God Sensei, the greatest UK in existence. And listen up, in this video, I'm gonna show you how not to lose badges on NBA 2K24. Now look, this video is very important. Comp guys, stage guys, no life, sweats, people who play OD. I don't know anybody that actually knows how to use their floor setters correctly. And I am going to teach you and really show you the method on how not to lose your badges everyone's thinking about this wrong okay so watch this full video play close attention or you're wasting your money bro you spend a hundred dollars a bill and you're just gonna be stressed out and you you wasting your floor sledders all that now make sure y'all subscribe if y'all are new help me hit 281k.8 we're like 60 subscribers away but yeah i'm gonna go over like every single badge so you understand what to floor set and what to put in your immunity and all that. So first off, unpluckable. Never floor set this badge, okay? A lot of y'all might be impatient, but there's no point to floor set this badge, bro. All someone has to do is reach on you and it goes and it upgrades, right? So that means it only has to happen once a game, okay? Very easy to maintain, all different type of builds. Very easy to maintain. And if you lose it, all you have to do is just keep spamming in front of someone um, like the AI or something and it'll eventually happen you, you call screens you just keep spamming all that and it, it'll happen speed booster never floor set this okay don't be lazy don't be stupid y'all be surprised what people floor set bro that's why I really have to go over this now look slithery eh very OP badge but listen 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 if you drive at all there's no point in floor setting this right it'll be easy to maintain but if for some reason you're just always never driving and you only shoot and somehow you can get this badge then i can understand it okay limitless range i don't think no shooting badges you should floor set a lot of people floor set the shooting badges you should never do that right you should not do that limitless range is the only one you should maybe floor set but if you're a guard or something Never floor set this. Never, okay? Maybe the centers and the locks, maybe. But you could get your limitless shots sometimes with just getting sharp take and shooting, you know. But still, you could put this in the immunity category, okay? And that, that's in your badge perks. I'm going to show you all that later, okay? Killer combos. If you are a guard, there's no reason to floor set this. You any type of drip, there's there's no reason, bro. Okay? Be smart, man. What you guys have to floor set are things that you would like to have that you rarely do. And you just bring it out every now and then. Like for instance, MIDI Magician. Very clutch, but you might not fade MIDI every game, depending on your mode and all that. So that is really a badge you could go for. Or maybe like the post fade, right? Or the post hook right or any of them layup badges those are the ones you want to aim for interceptor you don't want to floor set this right maybe but it's you know it's not something you because you press square all you got to do is tip a pass right tip a pass i think i don't know if you have to be successful but all you got to do is tip a pass i don't know it's it don't seem like something you know it seemed like if you got steel this shouldn't be something you floor set. Handles for days, don't floor set. Glove, again, all you gotta do is press square. Why would you floor set this? Don't, there's no point. Now, Giant Slayer might be something that you want to floor set. But again, if you're a bigger build, like the 6'8", maybe even the 6'6", six, six, it's kind of pointless to floor set, all right? Uh, maybe depending on the mode, but this is an F. Okay, this is an eh. dead eye. Don't floor set this. Everyone shoots the ball in the game. These badges are gonna pop up, bro. There's no reason to floor set this. These, it's easy to maintain when you play the game. You don't floor set this. And y'all let me know y'all's opinions. You don't you don't floor set this. Blow by, you don't floor set this. Blinders, you don't floor set this. You feel me? I messed up too, right? You don't floor set shooting badges. They're easy to maintain. You don't do it. 
Now, maybe if you're a spot up, maybe for the blinders and dead eye, but I doubt it, bro. Because, man, them hoes is going to pop up. And if anything, you could put them on immunity, right? I don't know, bro. Agent threes, you don't floor set, right? Especially for the guards. Especially for the guards. The blinders, dead eye, and agent threes, you don't floor set at all. Maybe for the, the locks and the spot ups. Maybe. But that you shouldn't even do that. Immunity, if anything, if you can't maintain it, bro. Do not floor set these as some type of guard, some type of handler, okay? Ankle braces, don't floor set this. Ankle breaker, don't floor set this. If you're especially if you're a guard, bro. It's 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 just so dumb, bro. <laughs> Catch and shoot. Don't floor set this. I've done this myself. Even as a guard, you're going to shoot catch and shoot shots. There's no point to floor set this. You're wasting. And you can't reset your floor sets, right? Don't floor set this. Yeah, this Y'all got to share this video, bro. This is very important. A lot of y'all are messing up your builds. You're floor setting the wrong things, bro. Challenger. No point to floor set this. Corner. Eh, possible for guards maybe um other than that i don't think there's a point to floor set this you see like your your spot up locks all that or the centers there's no point to floor set this dimer don't floor set green machine don't floor set hyperdrive this. don't floor set this precision dunker this is a maybe okay right you want to bring this hoe out every now and then or something this is something you could floor set but if you're like a master slasher, like me, or like a master stand and dunker with the meter, then you're not going to floor set this. But you still want that in your bag just in case you don't know, you get your slasher take or whatever. You know, you eventually want to get into it, but you don't want to do it all the time. This is something you would want to floor set. Right stick ripper, maybe. But you don't need to. All you got to do, you know. I think all you got to do is go for it, and it's, it seems very easy to maintain. Space Creator. Now, this may be something you want to floor set, because you might want to do it to get fancy, break someone's ankles, etc., but you don't do it every game. This is something you possibly would want to floor set, okay? Spot Finder. <laughs> Bro, this badge don't even go up for me. I don't, I don't, I don't even use this hoe. So I don't, I don't know. Maybe you, you know. Now the acrobat. This is something you would want to floor set. Something you don't do and all that, but you would want to do. Bunny. Another thing. Something you would want to floor set. Something you might want to do. Now, if you want to do this, okay? Cause some sometimes you get like the Hall of Fame, all that, okay? This is something you would want to aim for for floor setting. Claymore. You don't want to. You kind of don't want to floor set this. This is easy to maintain. Even sometimes on quick catch and shoots, just a little pause, that hole be popping up, right? This seems easy to maintain. So this is not something you really want to floor set. Comeback kit. This is something you want to aim for floor setting. Okay, if you begin blown out, especially you randoms, right? Or you could put this in the immunity category, right? Float game. This is something else you would want to floor set if this is something you want to have in your bag, but you don't do it every game. Guard up. Uh, maybe. I don't know about this one. But still, immunity back. Mini magicians, just like I told y'all earlier, bro. Very clutch, right? But if you don't do this every game, then you might want to floor set it. But it's easy to maintain, right? If you want to throw it in every now and then. But if you don't want to do all that, you don't, or you don't want to put it on immunity, then maybe you could floor set something like this. Open looks. Don't floor set this. Don't do it. Easy to maintain, bruh. Pro touch. Now, maybe this is something you want to floor set, okay? But it's, uh, you know, easy to maintain. If you do it, then you don't have to. But if every now and then, you know, possibility. Relay passer. Don't floor set scooper it's the same as the other layups uh badges that i'm talking about possibility you know this is something you would want to aim for in your floor setter triple strike no i, I hope y'all aren't floor setting this whistle no fast twitch 
I hear this whole barely even works, so nah, I don't, I don't think so. Free points, uh, masher, ah, uh, I'm not too sure. It seems if you're doing this, like it's gonna easily be maintainable. Off ball pass, no. Slippery off ball, no. Spin cycle, the same with the other layer badges I'm telling you about. This is something you would want to aim for. Two step, this is something you would want to aim for. You feel me? Now let's go to another build. Let's let's go to this build. It's more all around. Rebound chasing. Now if you got rebounding, you 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 don't you don't wanna do this, right? But uh, I don't I don't think this is something you go for, bro. Posterizer. I, I think this is easy to maintain, bro. I'm not gonna hold you. I don't I don't think this is something you go for. Maybe. 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 I, I think this pops up a lot. And then again, maybe immunity. Clamps. This is not something you go for. Now, this game is weird, okay? The only way to make clamps pop up is to not press R2 and to just hold L2 and get your bumps that way. Um, That's the only way it pops up, and that seems easy to maintain. Chase down artists. Mm, you don't you don't floor set this uh you get a block it just goes like it seemed like if you got this like it's easy to maintain because when you get one it, it just jumps like big like they they scaled it they scaled some of these badges you don't aim for this break starter maybe not not when you're at the higher level because you're going to be doing this all the time usually the s tier badges you don't need to really uh floor set them hoes i'm not gonna hold you no Pig Dodger, no. Dimer, no. Anchor, no. Workhorse, no. Rise up, bro. If you if you got this and, and you're dunking, no. You, you you don't need to do. Pogo stick, no. Movable enforcer, I don't I don't think so. Nah, bro. Maybe special delivery. I don't I don't I don't think so. But post playmaker, maybe. Post playmaker could be something. If this badge actually works that you can aim for this could be something you could aim for right you know if you got you on different levels maybe you know if you got it on the silver and gold and you don't really run into uh post scores a lot and you, this could be something you aim for brick wall no 94 feet all you have to do is press so th this don't seem like something you would want to floor set all you have to do is press and press l2 or whatever and it just active fast feet i don't i don't think this is something you need to uh floor set either needle threader i don't think you need to floor set this now dream shake this is something you might want to aim for you could just break people's ankles this might be something you want to aim for drop stepper might be something you want to aim for if you're not like always post scoring but you want to throw it in sometime hook specialist might be something you want to aim for post fade this might be something you want to aim for if you don't do it a lot, but you know you want to have it there. Post spin technician, the same thing. This might be something you not might not do, but you want to have it in there. Maybe it's really dependent on your style, but a lot I know people might say that, but a lot of people aren't really thinking, man, because they'll do something like catch and shoot, but there's no point because that's how you play. You gotta do oppo, but something you still want. That's the whole logic behind it that i think a lot of people aren't grasping and yeah like you see this is what i got going right now for this uh iso post fade and build right you see how i got these holes on immunity you know i got them on immunity while i'm playing but i still want them slithery yeah yeah you can have a slithery and all that you know but you see i even messed up my floor setters on this build right there's no point to do this i shoot catch and shoots all the time there's no point to do this, bro. No point. But yeah, this is like an extra floor setter, low key, because it's a slower regression. And then, you know, can kind of manage it better. It's kind of stressful with all this shit. Y'all let me know if y'all like losing badges and all that. I know this is a way to keep people on the game more and to get their badges upgraded before they go play over and over again. The same with the hot spots. Very annoying stuff, man. I don't know. Too tedious, man. I just want to hoop. But hey. Y'all click on this video on screen. I dropped three immaculate two-way builds. So send them hoes to your friends. Check them out yourself. Drop a comment, like, let me know what you But hey, hey, here we go again. Yeah. Here we go 
again People talking this, but when this hit the fan Everything I'm that made me Now break it down Yo, off the top of the dome, dome.